Hi guys and welcome to the Enhancement Shaman Alpha on the BFA changes and reworks. Um, this is one of the classes which has seen the least least done to it since Legion and that maybe Blizzard think they're in a comfortable position with it. There's only been a few changes, a few a few changes in the talents, but the core just the core like class and the talents and whatever is just the same. You're doing the same rotation really. But yeah, just a few changes. So I'll go through the single target talents first and then the AoE talents. There's not much change in the AoE and the single target. It's still insane, insane, insane single target, but the AoE is just really, really lacking. and They haven't really done anything to change that. For your first one, you can either take Total Mastery, but I just like to take Hot Hands because I'm gonna, I use Flameton quite a lot. And, you know, keeping Flameton up and getting my Lava Slash to be instant and not cost any Maelstrom. When it's the thing which costs you the most Maelstrom a lot of the time. That's just really good. Sear and Assault, always good. Like I said, I use Flame Tongue a lot. And now it just requires me to use it every every um, every um 6 seconds. Because well, every every time it's off cooldown. Because I want to keep that, that uh, dot up. Uh, next one you want to take, I just took Bold Fist. Wind Fury is good, but... If you want to play like individually and get your own DPS high, then don't take Wind Fury. Just take Boulder Fist, so your DPS is being higher. But Wind Fury helps the raid out a bit. But obviously Boulder Fist, because who cares about their DPS? Overcharge. I don't like using my Maelstrom on Lightning Bolt. It's just a bit awkward because you get you get used to using Lightning Bolt, and if you're not um, like if you're not if you're not used to clicking lightning bolt, it's hard to put it on your bars kind of thing. But yeah, um, next one you want to take is just Sundering. Just because you're only going to be using Crash Lightning when there's when there's um, when there's more than one target. So the Sundering is just good because 2,800 hit. Fury of Yeah is just trash. It uses up too much Maelstrom. And for the last one, Ascendance again. It just does so much damage when you go into it. And your Storm Strikes are just, just crazy. I'll demonstrate how much burst they can do. So, we took Feral Lunge as well, just so we can start the fight off. And that's what you want to start with. So, we'll put a few on ourselves. Pump Bloodlust, then Feral Lunge. Bloodlust. And then, let's just get, get your dots down first and use a few Rock Fighters. And then, use my Feral Spirits. Use my Storm Strike right before I go into my Ascendance. And then, go into Ascendance right now. Then, redo my dots. And now, I've got the Charge. So, you just... You just want to prior using your wind strike, and then using your lava, um, using your lava slash on on a uh, on cooldown. But just make sure you're using that big damage of uh, wind wind hail. And obviously, then when I had the ascendance, I should have used my spare maelstrom on the sundering. But as you can see, I'm getting loads of procs. It's really good procs. Just make sure you've got as soon as flame Tongue comes off cooldown, you gotta ha hit that straight back on. So you just prior in using your, as soon as Rock Putter comes off cooldown, you just use that charge again. And obviously as soon as you get an instant prop, it's really fun and dynamic. Like it's really, it's just a fun spot to play because you don't really know what's ha going to happen. Your, your rotation is going to change all the time. Like if I get a prop now, I've got to, yeah, I've got to use my Swarm Strike. And it's just, yeah, just prior in. But yeah, they've added a few new animations, like the Lava Slash animation's new. It's really cool. Like you just spin around. But you now see I've got my spare maelstrom, so just use my sundering, because that's going to do big damage. And just smash, 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 smash. But yeah, you just want to make sure you're dumping your maelstrom. Just dumping that maelstrom into them. Rock biters. Forgot to use them. Just keep up your rock biters and just smash, 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 smash. So it's basically the same as, like, it's literally the same as Legion. There's nothing more to it. But I'll show you the AoE. AoE talents you can take, but you really don't want an enhanced for AoE. Like, it's just really, really stupid. Hot hands, yeah, just keep it. The only one you can really change is, I think it's just, it's Fury of the Air, because you can just dump your Maelstrom into the target. And yeah, you want to take Ascendance again, just because, you know, you have more DPS, but Fury of the Air is really good. So when you go into Ascendance, you can just use Fury of the Air, and you'll just have loads and loads of, um, loads and loads of Maelstrom dumping, because it uses free Maelstrom every every um few seconds it obviously deals damage to a lot of people and it's rechargeable but you just gotta know when to click it off and when to click it on because the longer you have it up the more maelstrom it's gonna take but you just gotta make sure you, that when you use it you know that you've got a lot of 
spells like Rock Biter to get loads of Maelstrom back up. So, just do the same again. Start off with Feral Lunge. Wait before you get your dogs out and just get your Rock Biters up. Lava Slash Instant makes you using that. And then just use my, um, makes you use an Electrifying, uh, a Crash Lightning, sorry, so it hits all the targets and just Lava Slash. And then you can put up your Fear of the Air. This is what your main DPS will be. So you're just going to make sure as soon as you use that, you're just keeping your Maelstrom up. So that you can just keep using your Fury of the Air and it's hitting all the targets. But as you can see, it's really, really weak in AoE. Like, the weakest, weakest spec for AoE, I think, I feel on the Alpha. You just have nothing. Absolutely nothing. And even with the AoE you have, like Crash Lightning, it's really hard to keep up. But as you can see, you just keep up your uh, Fury of the Air. And obviously, when you go into Ascendance, you're just going to have so much Astral Power. Uh, Maelstrom, sorry. <laughs> Astral Power, what am I saying? And you can just smash the ads. But yeah, it's en enhanced is just single target train. You, if you take it for AoE, you're just doomed. You, they just have no AoE. But yeah. Anyway, this was a quick guide because not much has changed on enhancement. But see you in the next few guides I'm going to do. Later.